Hello friends. Today's short video is all about why you want to make sure that you prune and thin Asian pear trees. Now a couple of years ago I topped this tree just to kind of keep it under control uh, in a small you know, urban backyard. But you can see here, I thought I didn't have to thin them. I just thought, eh, I just did the major pruning, everything will be, be okay. Well, as you see here, it looks good. Lots of fruit. Seems like that's what you'd want. But in reality, if you have this kind of fruit, you just get fruit of this size or smaller. You know, and these are, Asian pears are usually like a full-size apple size. But because this tree is so prolific, and there's so many fruit that I did not prune it adequately enough or thin it, uh, I've got a lot of small fruit. Now it made a lot of great dried fruit. I would rather be eating large, mature Asian pears than a bunch of small ones. But it's hard to, you know, I'm the one that doesn't like to get rid of fruit. So I'm kind of the thinning and is not my strong point. Because thinning isn't my strong point, I need to prune this tree appropriately so that I just get rid of, get rid of the potential fruit uh, that's going to make more small fruit than large fruit. So I'm better at that. So here's time lapse of me just shaping this tree and, and cutting it back drastically. Now this year's harvest should be a lot smaller, but they should hopefully be better fruit. Now here's a look at the carnage after the pruning. And as you see, I leave several main leaders and some side shoots. And I've topped it again so that we don't have it grow too tall. We don't want to shade the other uh, trees that I have in this uh, side of the yard. But as you see, it's going to be a lot less fruit, probably, and it's going to be in a lot more control. So we'll see how this goes this year. Now, I can't neglect to mention that the best time to prune fruit trees is when they're dormant. Uh, you can do some pruning during the active growing season, but it's better to uh, prune while the tree is asleep. But you want to make sure that you get the pruning done before this happens, before the blooms start coming out, because all the energy needs to go into, in, into the growth of the, of the tree as it's coming out of dormancy, because it puts on flowers quick, puts on the fruit very quick, and they'll start sizing up pretty rapidly once they get going until their mature stage. So it'll be exciting to see if my pruning totally destroys my crop this year and I get very little, or if what I do get is significant and of a good quality and size. So I'm still experimenting with all this, and, and uh, but Asian pears are a great fruit. Uh, they're a very prolific tree, unlike apples that take years and years to produce. Asian pears give you some fruit you know, very quickly. I highly recommend adding an Asian pear tree to your yard if you don't have one already, but just make sure that you prune them and thin the fruit. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.